A force is any push or pull. Forces can be contact forces, that's when objects are physically touching, like when you push a door, or they can be non-contact, like magnetism. We can represent forces with vectors, that is, an arrow that shows the direction and magnitude of the force. If two forces act on an object, there's a resultant force. We find this by technically adding the vectors. However, if they're going in opposite directions, one must be negative. If vectors are at right angles to each other, you use Pythagoras to find the resultant. If forces are balanced, that is, they add up to zero, that means that the object will not accelerate. It won't change velocity. Note that doesn't necessarily mean it's not moving. It just stays at a constant velocity, and that could be zero meters per second, of course. This is Newton's first law of motion, by the way. If a measurement or quantity just has magnitude but no direction, it's not a vector, but it's called a scalar instead. Here are some examples of both. Note that displacement is distance travelled with a direction, while similarly velocity is the vector form of speed.